Hi, welcome to Miss Sarah's Math Corner. Here's another example of multiplying decimal hundredths by one digit whole number. So as we talked about in the previous videos, uh, multiplying decimals is very, very simple, as long, of course, as you have practiced multiplying regular numbers. So what we're going to do to make our life easier is every time we're, um, we have an option here to multiply with decimals, we're actually going to remove it. It's going to make things a lot easier to process and so we don't get our numbers mixed up. So because I have a whiteboard, I could just erase it if I wanted to and turn this to 6,842 times 6. Or I could always rewrite it as well like I did in the last video. But what I think I'm going to do this time is I'm just going to erase it and just proceed like I normally would. I would just remind myself, of course, that I had 68 and 42 hundredths to begin with when I get to the end. So nice and simple, 6 times 2 is 12. 4 times 6 is 24, plus 1 at the top is 25. 6 times 8 is 48, plus 2 is 50. All right, then 6 times 6 is 36, plus 5 is 41. Okay, so if I was doing this like a normal multiplication, 6,842 times 6, I have the answer of 41,052. But because I know, I remember that I was doing with decimals, I'm making sure that I'm going to add that back in to remind myself that I need those decimal, the decimal places in the answer as well. So the trick is, remember, every time I have decimals in the question, of course I'm going to need those decimals in the answer. And however many decimal places you have in the question, that's how many are in the answer. So here I have two decimal places because I'm dealing with hundredths. So two decimal places in the answer, there it is. So the answer for 68 and 42 hundredths times 6 is 410 and 52 hundredths. Thanks, stay tuned for some more practice with decimals.